So we're here with uh, Afe Lim. So who are you? Uh, yeah, thank you very much. Good morning. Uh, I'm, my name is Mr. Michel Popovic. I'm the chairman of Afe Lim. Afe Lim is a French association for printing electronic. And uh, now we have more than 56 members. So this is a print electronic association in France. Yes. And you have all these uh, companies? Yes, all these companies belong to this association. 56 companies. So we have most of them are industrial companies involved in different sectors. So what's the point in having an association? What do they do together? The, the goal together is to develop the networking, to work in international, uh, to, do, to, to develop the, the new applications, to meet the end users and to find the, the killer applications which will be the, developed and produced in mass production very uh, very soon. Because printed electronics is, is fantastic, it's awesome, right? Yes. So how soon is it going to be everywhere? Yes, yes. The goal, the goal today, we, we developed the application in the, in the, in the medical fields, in, uh, in the security fields, uh, and also we are working in automotive and robotics. So many of uh, those uh, uh, members are around here at the yes, show, at yes, IETECH. Yes, yes, so most of we, them are there, yes. Can we talk with some of them? Can we yes. around? Yes, we start with the, with the first. Uh, yeah, maybe with this one? Uh, this one? Jinzing? Yeah. yeah. So we go around here. So, hey. Hey, so who are you? Hello, I'm Gregoire Stalens from Genesis Inc. We are a French manufacturer of uh, conductive and semi-conductive ink. Can we see? Over here? Yeah. So what kind of a... So we which one are you doing? Uh, we keep in touch with our R&D. So we have uh, yeah. here an LED on the surface. We have put it with a conductive blue. Here it's a um, screen printing uh, sample. Uh, this one? Here you can see um, OLED, OLED device, yeah. all printing OLED device. But, um, so historically, by, uh, we started with the... Great. So, uh, bringing all this to market, how, uh, is it on the market? Excuse me? Is it possible to buy all this stuff? Yes, sure. We, we can provide small quantity for laboratory or big quantity for mass production um, industry. Yes. You have Take more partners. That, uh, we have all the partners around, so we can we can we can yeah. continue with uh, the yeah. Arkema. Arkema right. was one of the most important uh, members. So I introduced. Hello. Hi. Fabrice. How are you? So who are you? I'm Fabrice Domagel Santos. I'm a CEO of Piezotech. So Piezotech is a advanced chemical company, part of the Arkema Group. Arkema is a chemical group, and we are developing uh, electroactive polymers and uh, inks based on these electroactive polymers. So, uh, is the stuff over here? Yes, for example, with these polymers, we can... Uh, these polymers have uh, different uh, kind of applications. Is this sound? Them. Yes, this is sound. This is a sound? printed speaker. Printed speaker? Yeah. yeah. That's amazing, no? Yeah. So, how do you make that? Uh, with, so, in, in, in this case, you have a substrate based on uh, PET, I think. You put uh, PDOS electrodes, transparent electrodes. Then you put a layer of uh, polymers. Or inks, then a layer of peanut, then you activate it by putting the voltage in order to activate, you fold it, and then you have a device. And so the device can be used as sensors and as actuator. So they vibrate? It vibrates, so you can create uh, uh, speakers, you can create uh, actuators, for example, for catheters, you can create. We are developing a lot of applications for, for our customer and our partner, developing applications for haptic devices to make a surface vibrating. For example, here you have an example where the polymer has been uh, molded on the substrate of a polycarbonate piece and then, but it's not connected, and then if you touch on that, it will uh, provide a haptic feedback. That's awesome. Yes, for automotive industry, for example. Here you have an example of the other kind of application, more in the sensing application. So here, but it's not connected. Then you just print the polymer and then, thanks to these piezo properties, it will deliver a signal that will be proportional to the force you apply. That's awesome. It would be great if uh, you didn't have to connect it. Could you yes. have a, f a flexible battery or something? So in this case, uh, for the future, so this polymer generates their own voltage. So also there is, a, there is a lot of development in the field of energy harvesting. When you push, when you put a force on the, on the, on the, on the polymer, it generates its own voltage. Then it can be used, for example, to, uh, uh, to send a Bluetooth signal or to light uh, low uh, energy display. Come on. You working on this? We are working. Our partners are working on this because me, I'm just working to be at uh, ID Tech X and uh, have the booth. This is really cool. Awesome. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Thank you.
So, uh, so you have more. more you yes, have, uh, we can show you other companies also. Yeah. Involved in different in, in different applications. So we have uh, people doing the printing, art yeah. and the people doing inspection uh, in core system. Let's go check this one out. Okay. So is somebody from the company around here? Artej. Yeah. So please. Uh, yes. Some, some words uh, about Artej and your yeah. activity. So, so who are you? Okay. I have to come here. Okay. Yeah. So who so, are you? My name is Pascal Piron. I'm yeah. the CEO of Ardege. And so here we are pleased to introduce uh, for our origin the 100 printers. So, so what is a printer? This printer is, a, let's say, um, a printer dedicated to print electronics materials. And so you can use, let's say, available commercially printed. So you can start at the origin. So let's say to define all the parameters of the process. And you can go step forward up to the industry, what we call the infinity. And so here, what you see, it's, let's say, we are using, let's say, some already uh, let's say uh, standard stuff, let's say to define all the process parameters and uh, when you achieve, let's say, all these parameters and hold the process in your hands, then you can go for production and industry. Can we check this out? So this comes out of the, the printer? Yes, it's very interesting because it's uh, some samples, it's uh, the antennas yeah. that we have printed here. And so you can, you can remove What is the pattern we see here? So the pattern here, it's a chill. It's a chill to, to let's say, to uh, protect from, uh, let's say, yeah. Uh, your mobile phone or to stop Wi-Fi, uh, let's say, uh, webs and so on. So it's, uh, you see this... Um, shield? Yes. And we have shield. And this one here, it's, uh, let's say, dedicated to, to finalize, let's say, some uh, sensors or something like that. So you can uh, you can see easily what we what we try to print, so not so easily. And this is interesting because here we have printing the antenna, okay, flexible substrate. Here you have the reader, so we print the antenna of the reader. And here we print the tag of each, let's say you see you have five, and if I remove one, this one is too far, and so it, the, the, the reader can see that uh, this uh, tag is too far. So we have demonstrated that with this machine we are able to bring convective material to achieve antenna on different substrates for the reader and for the for the RFID tags. Nice. What are we looking at here? It's the same, but more flexible, uh, not flexible, rigid materials. So. All right. Cool, so uh, more and more stuff is happening in this area. Yeah, yeah sure. Getting busy and more and more? More and more. Each right. day and each way. Yeah. It's great. All right. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Okay. All right. Thank you. And uh, the last but not the least, the the the, the other company which we we we, we uh, in core system, which yeah. is involved in inspection, inspection yeah. and control of the printing. So Mathilde will introduce a little bit more this activity. Hello. So hello. So who are you? Matilda. Matilda. I'm Matilda. Working for in core system, specialized in image processing technology, line scan camera based scanning full surface for quality control. So okay. there is uh, uh, your technology in there? Yes, technology. We are specialized in web inspection, online automatic surface inspection and measurements with full traceability solutions, tracking and tracing from uh, the raw material to the final product and a metrology and characterization platform for offline <laughs> inspection with a NICS white table combining two key technologies, camera scanning the full substrate and thickness measurements as well. So quality control and process monitoring for product quality control of uh, what kind of uh, is it for printed electronics? Or? For printed electronics, any kind of surface and flat surfaces, should it be printed or not, transformed or not, from raw material to final product. And these are uh, you making this in France? Yes, we are designing, manufacturing, and supplying all the solutions from yeah. France. The know-how is based on the software solution, so it's not only image acquisitions. We are more than a camera provider. We are providing the full software tools as well for the data processing in real time and cross-process management as well for quality. All right, so are there many of these machines out in the world? Are you Sorry. selling many already? Yes, we are. 70% of our activity is done uh, abroad, out of uh, France, in Europe and out of Europe as well. That's a very high priority for France to export a lot of cool technology. Yes, this is uh, as well our core activity, so we are quite flexible and uh, open-minded. Are you the best at doing this? Well, I can say that we are the best in what we are doing. <laughs> That's great. All right. Thanks a lot. Thank You're you. Welcome. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you very much for your tour. And uh, also, you have these guys over we there, right? We have also these guys. They are also members of Affelim. So you have uh, Seradrop MG, who also produce the, the inkjet printers. You have uh, Isorg. They are building the, the big factory and uh, develop the sensors. So they, they are the printing company doing sensors. Also, Arjo Begins. 
the, the creative paper. So they developed the, the, uh, the smart paper with the, with, the, with, the, with the tag inside. So you wish to, to make a small round to see them also? Uh, well, maybe I'll try to film their booth separately. So okay. this is great. So at uh, and, uh, this association that you have, uh, there's more and more interest and uh, yes, there's growth. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are growing better, and better we, are, we try to address all different markets that develop the new products. And as I already mentioned, we, need, we really try to have the good connection with end users for the, for the, for the application and to do new developments. And there's 50 members, you say, right? 56. 56, and some of them suddenly become super successful, right? And yes, others yes. are uh, developing their developing, research. Exactly. And, yeah, yeah. and Isorg is a very new, very big plant, which, which is built, uh, which will be ready in 2017, and they will start the mass production in 2017 in Limoges. So France is uh, pretty good at this. Yes, at yes. doing all this printed electronic stuff. Yeah, we try to what do our the best. best. Ah, I do have other big players. Germany is probably the best, and uh, also the US are in advance. And we have a lot of. Uh, in terms of the the R and D, the France has a very good position. In terms of the mass production, the, the Asian countries are probably a little bit in advance.